Oh, well, hello there. I suppose it's high time we got these physics predictions up onto the internet. The old YouTubes. Uh, right, I'm going to start, as always, with the ordinary level. The most likely topics you're going to get this year in order are number one, electricity, voltage and wattage. Number two, sound waves. Number three, magnetism and conductors. Number four, Newton and acceleration due to gravity. Number five, nuclear fission slash fusion. Uh, number six, radioactivity. Number seven, total internal reflection slash refraction. Number eight, heat transfer. Do you want to tell the boys and girls what's come up as number nine? Go on in, tell them. Quick, they're waiting. So say number nine is wave. waves. Waves. Yeah. Number 10 is, this is a hard one, semiconductor and PN junction. That's good. Um, and that's most of the stuff there. Now, what kind of experiments are coming up this year, do you think? I'd say measure the specific latent heat of ice, then to measure the wavelength of monochromatic light, verify Snell's law. Uh, measure acceleration, that means how fast you go. The um, investigate variation of current with potential difference for a filament bulb. There's a mouthful now. Do you want to say that one? Is that too hard? Yeah. Investigate the variation of current with potential difference for copper sulfate and copper electrodes. Uh, number seven, to determine the specific latent heat of the vaporization of water. Number eight, to measure the focal length of a converging lens. Number nine, Show the variation of resistance of a thermistor with temperature. And number 10, verify the laws of equilibrium for a set of closed planar forces. This is a tough subject, isn't it? Right, higher level. Number one is your chosen electric, uh, elective option, obviously. Number two, tell them it's waves. Waves. Yeah. Number three is resistance. Resistance. Number four is momentum force and power. power! Number five is heat capacity or latent heat. So it's about things being too hot. Um, number six is refraction of lens. Uh, refraction and lens, etc. Number seven is heat transfer. of heat on this paper. Number eight is pressure. Can you see that one? Pressure. Pressure. Yeah. Number nine is Newton and motion. Number ten, electrostatics, coulomb, etc. Eleven, thermometric properties, uh, 12 current flow in amps and 13 radioactivity, 14 colours of light and 15, can you say that word? Sound. Nice one. And then the experiments, you ready? The most likely one is to measure the focal length of a converging lens, uh, number two is to verify Boyle's law, number three, measure acceleration hey, look at this. due to gravity, yeah that's a fun book. I knew it worked with Uncle Owen. He is, yeah. Look at the camera. Number four is measure the, the specific heat capacity of water using copper. Five is measure the focal length of a concave mirror. That's all my drink. Help keep me sane while doing predictions for Leaving Search. Now, um, number six is to measure the variation of resistance of a wire with temperature. Seven is measure variation of current, or investigate the variation of current potential difference for a semiconductor diode. Number eight, to determine the specific, specific latent heat of vaporization of water. Number nine, show that acceleration is proportional to force. Ten, verify the laws of equilibrium for a set of coplanar forces. Eleven, measure the speed of sound in air. And twelve, yeah, number twelve is variation in, of resistance of a thermistor with temperature. Oh my god. That's enough, I think. That's enough talk for them to study, isn't it? Yeah. We'll leave it there. We'll say goodbye to everyone. See ya. Good luck in your exam. <laughs>